Hey guys, Gumpla Newbie here. Today I'll be unboxing and reviewing something quite interesting. Now if you've done a fair bit of painting yourself, you know that you need to shake the paint bottle so all the paint pigments are broken up and mixed properly. And I've bought a device specifically for that job. So I've got this from Taobao, China, and the brand of this device is Alchemy. So I've done a little bit of research and found out that there are various paint stirrers or agitators out there. And some you have to strap the bottle onto the device itself for some serious shaking. And some you press the paint bottle onto the device and it will start vibrating. That's how they mix the paint. And the one that I've got is a magnetic stirrer. So based on what I've read, these are typically used in laboratories where they mix, you know, some liquid solution, chemical, that kind of stuff. So from what I've read, it works by inserting a metal stir bar into the liquid and the device creates a rotating magnetic field, which will make the bar spin quickly. So essentially it creates a vortex by spinning the stir bar quickly. When I bought this device, it came included with these little stir bars and I can also get additional ones at a cheap price. Now before I got this device, I've actually been using these empty paint bottles with ball bearings in them. I'm actually not sure if it'll work with the stirrer. So let's give it a try. The ball bearings unfortunately doesn't work. It felt like there's some magnetic attraction but not strong enough for it to move much. The magnetic attraction towards these bars are much stronger. Let's see how it works in an empty bottle. Yeah, it can be a bit noisy, and since I can't really control the power of the device, I think it's recommended to keep the lid on. Let's try it on a bottle with some gloss clear. Here we go! So it seems like you have to put it like on the dead center of the device. Otherwise the magnet wouldn't rotate correctly. It could be a little bit difficult to work correctly with a small bottle like this. So this looks like I put it in the center correctly, but yeah, it's not rotating correctly. So I need to make a little bit of adjustment here. There we go. Minor complaint, yeah. But I don't think it will be a problem with bigger bottles like 30 milliliters or something like that. So if you exclusively use small paint bottle like these, yeah, it could be a little bit troublesome to get right every time. Otherwise, it works great. Overall, I think it works pretty well, especially for the cheap price. And I think it works really well for the price that I paid. The only drawback that I could think of is that it requires these metal stir bars, but that's not too hard for me to get, at least for me. The Taobao seller mentioned that the bars are specially treated so that they don't rust. So for this product, would I recommend it? Do you even need one? Personally, I think it's a pretty neat product to have. When you're doing a big project with a lot of painting, it can be handy to have an inexpensive device that does a very good job of mixing up the paint. Some paint or colors can be very thick and can be a pain to mix evenly. If you have the budget, go for it, but it's not even expensive anyway. Is it needed? Probably not. You just gotta use some elbow grease. Now I can't seem to find the same brand or the exact device that I use here on Amazon. So I'll link similar products in the description. You know, I get a small commission if you buy something from my link, but at no extra cost to you guys. Lastly, if you like my content, please remember to like and subscribe. And if you would like to support the channel directly, you can consider buying me a cup of coffee. Links are in the description. So that's it. Thank you for watching. I don't have to catch it and freeze.